What's up, my friends and the viewers of the tube? Today, I'm gonna to show you how you can actually off-ramp your crypto and pay bills with it. This is game-changing because I know some of us have some shit coins that we would rather just use to maybe pay bills or um, you know whatever the case is. So I'm gonna show you how you can actually use your crypto to pay bills, and this is game-changing. So let's get into the juicy, juicy details. So as you can see, this is uh, Sprints, Spritz. Finance, and I just logged in to create an, an account, and now I need to verify my account. And so I'm going to put in my phone number here. This is just a, uh, a Google Voice number that I use. And then, um, and by the way, this is not my phone number either. Nor do I live on Main Street, so uh, feel free to harass whoever that is. Just kind of do not do that. That is a horrible thing to do. And so I'm going to go ahead and uh, send a verification. And then I should get a five digit code. I'm gonna go over to my Google um, voice number right here, grab this five digit code and go ahead and paste it in there. I guess that pasting didn't work because I had the space. So I'm gonna go seven, four, four, four. So I am now verified. I'm gonna put in my address here and my date of birth. I'm gonna fill out all this information obviously. So um, that way I am set up and ready to go. And once this is set up, I'll show you the next step. So go through, verify your um, information, get everything added so that you can start paying your bills with crypto. And we'll show you how you do that right now. So after you have verified, they do give you some great incentives. Uh, get $10 towards your first payment on each new bill, uh, a passing verification. So there's a few options we can do here. You can either pay your bank, Let's uh, spritz, find your bills, or search for bills yourself. I'm actually gonna search for bills myself. I do wanna pay my car loan because I do have, if you have followed any of my channel, you definitely know that I rent out my vehicle for passive income, and I just got a new car uh, through Texas, uh, Southland Credit Union. So in doing so, I'm able to uh, pay that. So if we go to Southland, no, not Southland. Credit Union, it's uh, Credit Union of Texas. And right here, and so now I need to add my account number. So obviously for privacy reasons, I'm not gonna put my account number up here. So I'll show you the next steps. So it wasn't able to find my auto loan for whatever reason. So it did find all my, uh, essentially my accounts. Uh, so I do have a few accounts here. All my credit cards are uh, at zero except for this one. And that kind of surprised me actually, uh, to say the least. So as you can see, I do have um, uh, qualified payments. Um, my last payments, I guess, was due March 1st. It's really weird, actually. This is, um, I'm actually glad I actually did this, and I'll tell you why. Because I thought I canceled this card, and uh, when I when they rec when they scanned my personal account, they found that this had a balance on it, and lo and behold, there was a seven hundred and fifty dollar balance, uh, which was just a bunch of wine and some other things and for whatever reason it didn't cancel so i'm going to just use my crypto to pay this off since it can't find my auto loan and so let's uh take care of this so i'm actually going to pay up uh, 150 i think that i had of my, of my um of my crypto that i got uh in my wallet and so i'm going to go ahead and just do because i think i have to do 149 because it's obviously the fees. Um, the total bill I'm going to be actually get paid for is 157, 159 because I can't read apparently um, because I am getting that $10 credit. And then uh, there is a 90 cents fee. So I'm going to be paying 149. And so I'm going to be allowing to pay with uh, USDC. And I'm going to approve this payment. I'm already connected to my wallet. It looks like I forgot to put some gas. So let's actually put some uh, gas in here because that would be a, uh, a good thing to do. It is going to cost me about $8. So that ga gas fee of $8. And we'll show you what happens next. So let me get some gas 
on this new wallet and show you guys how it works. So I did approve the transaction uh, to be able to use USDC. Now I actually have to pay with USDC. Uh, the first uh, payment or fee was about $3 or so. Um, I just switched up my, my um, price of my Gwen, GUI or however you say it. And I am now setting the price for uh, my um, paying this actual fee. So without further ado, let's actually go through the process. I am now uh, just finishing up here. We'll save this. Hopefully we can get it down to the amount that is in my wallet so that I can actually pay uh, the rest of this uh, payment. And so we'll come back after it's actually paid because um, I just happen to have $150 in Ethereum USDC, and so lo and behold, we get to pay a lot in gas fees. So yippee, chai, pay. And there we are. So the payment has been sent. Uh, it shows that uh, the bill is on the way and it should take two, three to four days to complete it. The total payment was uh, 159 and it's going to my uh, balance. So if this is something you guys wanna do, they do have this on multiple blockchains. I just happened to have $150 on USDC that I was not using. And so I wanted to create this video and show you guys how you can build pay with, um, with this amazing platform. There is a link down below for a referral link if you guys want to sign up and if you found this valuable. Uh, as you know, um, hey, if you get $50 and I get $50, it's a win-win. And you know, I, I just wanted to show what is, uh, possible with crypto, but let's get into some of the other things that uh, the other blockchains and other parts of this platform. They do have this amazing feature, which is their uh, debit card that allows you to add crypto to your uh, kind of a virtual credit card or debit card rather. And so you can actually fund your uh, card with crypto. And if that's using either of these blockchains, the Polygon blockchain, BNB, Optimism, uh, Arbitrum, or Avalanche, and then you can use that through, say, uh, let me actually switch this, either through your Google account or your Apple Pay card. Um, if you look at, if we just go back here um, real quick, you can see that, uh, I will cancel the payment, that it says, please allow one hour before attempting to add the card to your Apple Pay or Google Pay wallet. So it, they do have a countdown for the hour and you're able to now have a virtual credit card to make purchases uh, with your crypto as if like you were using your regular debit card. But now it's actually a virtual debit card that you can hook up to your phone, which is pretty, pretty sweet. So looking at the different blockchains, there are quite a bit. You can use Polygon, BNB, Optim uh, Optimism, Arbitrum, uh, Avalanche, C-Chain, and then obviously Ethereum. Ethereum probably being the most expensive, followed by uh, probably Polygon, uh, probably BNB and then Polygon. Uh, BNB is definitely more expensive than Polygon. Um, as far as the other ones, it's probably been, I would say it's actually uh, Ethereum, uh, BNB, Avalanche, Polygon, and then Optimism and uh, Arbitrum as the final two. I think those are like fractions of the penny. So Polygon's about four cents, I'm guessing. BNB is about 40 cents per transaction. Avalanche is probably around 40 cents. Um, and then the other two are much cheaper. So uh, there you go. Choose the crypto that uh, you love. Off-ramp it to your bank account. Um, or just pay your bills with crypto because it allows you to the flexibility of being able to pay your bills and uh, use crypto to do that. And now we have everyday use cases for crypto and to pay our bills, which is pretty sweet to say the least. So that's it guys. Um, I hope this was enlightening. There is a link down below if you want to get access uh, 
get fifty dollars for uh, joining using my referral link. Uh, I get fifty dollars, you get uh, fifty dollars. So I do definitely appreciate that. And uh, welcome to this amazing platform. So until next time, guys, remember to like and subscribe, and I'll see you on the next one. Peace.